myths live through all of us. The reason we have passed our great stories and legends down for so many years, thousands of years, is because we need them. And in a way, they need us to continue to survive. Girls in Trouble is a journey that I've been on for 14 years. And it's really the combination of my passion for writing and for music, Torah, and feminism. And now we're bringing it from music to TV. In each episode, we'll explore how one biblical woman's story can help us understand our own complicated modern lives. I sing in the first person in my imagination of these women's voices because I'm always drawn to, to the pure vulnerability of a human being sharing their experience from the inside. And we'll introduce you to other artists and activists whose work resonates with biblical stories. When you make something and you write and you create and you externalize, but in this physical form that you can then hand on, is that you're adding your voice in a very permanent way to the ongoing conversation, but it's your voice, so it does start with you. Jacqueline Nichols is an incredible artist based in London. She's a, a feminist artist. She's also a Jewish educator like myself, so she has a very deep background in Torah. And she can combine her feminism with a profound academic and spiritual knowledge of Torah and translate them into her incredibly skilled and, and beautiful and capacious artwork. Can anything be sadder than work left unfinished? Yes, work never begun. When I saw this quote from Christina Rossetti, it resonated and it also motivates me. It's above my, I wrote it on the window above my drawing desk here in my studio. I think the stories of women in Torah are such a huge part of the story of what it means to be human. And they can help us understand ourselves in a way that we can't understand ourselves without them to retell these stories from an imagination of the women's point of view, it kind of puts the center of gravity in a different place and I think it helps us understand some of the lessons and the beauty and just the narrative drama of the Torah. You have to begin. You have to just start. You have to enter the conversation and just see where that takes you. I love that. So you're part of a longer... I think there's part of a longer tradition of... a tradition of tricksters and troublemakers and playful... Um, very serious playing with the text. This behind-the-scenes concept trailer is a little taste of what's to come.